Hey guys, this is Thomas from World Tavern, and this is going to be a quick setup video uh, to walk you through how to navigate, log in on the new online dashboard. So, real easy. All you're going to do is you're going to go to worldtavernpoker.online. That's worldtavernpoker.online. This is for all your online gaming play with World Tavern. So once you get to the website, all the information is here, how to play, schedule of events, champs and prizes, user guides, FAQs, the whole nine yards. When you're coming here to play, you're just going to simply click the login button, and that'll take you to a login for the online dashboard. You're going to put in your username, your password, and click login. If you don't remember your password, you're going to click the forgot password button right here. It's simply going to ask you to enter your email address. You click reset password after you do that. Check your email, click the link in the email, and it'll walk you right through. You will have to log back in, but it's very easy. All right, since I know my password, I'm just going to click the login button, and it'll take us to the online dashboard. Now, all of these rankings that you see on the screen are for your online play only. Uh, the rankings on worldtavernpoker.com, of course, the national rankings and all that include your live play. So we're going to walk through this real quick. You have your national rankings here, and you can check uh, the quarter. We're in September, October 2020, and when it gets to November, that'll start a new quarter. So on the national rankings, you'll be able to click through that. Venue rankings has all the venues that are active that you can check your venue rankings, just like a tavern ranking. And then your national cumulative points is for this quarter. So this is the grand total of points people have earned. When you scroll down, you'll see the leaderboard for build your bankroll. And this is the monthly bankroll standings. You can see September, October. Uh, of course, that'll change monthly. These are all the bankrolls of players that have earned virtual bankroll dollars in the month of October. Um, so you can scroll all the way down here. You can go through the whole list, just like you can up here with all these 1s through 11s. You can scroll through. It just shows the top 15 here. All right. Now, you can also, in the top right of your screen, you can click your avatar here. You can change your profile, add a little picture if you want. You can see that Twinkle Toes already did. Uh, so go ahead and do that. Now, when you want to register for a tournament, you're going to click the Tournaments tab at the top. Click Upcoming Tournament. And all of the tournaments that are for today are available to register. Now, it is 3 o'clock when I'm doing this, so obviously the Nooners has already ended. If you click the Register button, it will register you. It will say that you're registered, but you're not actually registered. Just disregard that. Okay, so since late registration for the day drinkers is still ongoing, I'm going to click register. And at the top right of the screen, it says that I have been registered successfully. And you can do that for any game here on this screen. When it comes time to play the game, all you have to do is click the play now button. So once again, you're going to register right here for games. When it comes to game time or just before, you have to click the Play Now button. And once you click the Play Now button, it opens up the lobby. And as you can see, I registered for the Day Drinkers Tournament. So I am sitting out, and I'll click Ready, and here I go. Again, this is the old, uh, not the old, but this is the lobby where you used to have to register for games and all that stuff. You can still register for tournaments here if you want to, um, but much easier to go through the dashboard. So I'll just sit back out and let them take my chips for a little while. Okay, so again, that's where all these events are. You just click the register button. Um, if you want to register for an upcoming tournament that hasn't started yet, you'll notice that it says that you're registered, and then an unregister button will appear here. So if you decide later you don't want to play, click unregister, and it'll take you out of the tournament. Okay, the My Rankings tab is a work in progress that is not working currently. However, also under the Tournaments tab, you can click Tournaments Played and it will show you the history of your tournaments that you've played. Obviously, I've not played a lot over the past few months, but many of you will have this thing scrolled all the way down to the bottom of the screen. So again, you can check all of the, all of the tournaments that you've played uh, through here, and that is pretty much it. So once again, going back to the leaderboard section, it has all your leaderboards and all that stuff here. You're going to register for tournaments right through here. Like I said before, register for tournaments. Make sure you click the Play Now button, and you'll be good to go. All right, thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed it.